Thanks for tuning in to WSKI TV 17. It's time to take a check of your latest local forecast on this Monday morning. You can always find this anytime on your internet devices at WSKITV.com. Updated twice daily. And this weather report is also brought to you by Geppetto's right in Village West. Well, for today, we'll see uh, the last day of the cold, cold temperatures out there. So you're going to want to bundle up. Grab those mittens rather than those gloves, a face mask, as well as maybe go over to the Downhill Supply Company and grab some hand warmers or some toe warmers and take often breaks as well out there. But the snow conditions are in great shape, so get out there and enjoy. We'll see partly sunny skies, increasing clouds throughout the day today, high temperatures right in the lower uh, teens. Mostly cloudy skies for Tuesday. Looks like we could see some overnight snow, 2 to 4 inches, as temperatures warm up as well. We'll see temperatures on Tuesday getting up into the upper 20s and we'll see a uh, southwest breeze as well that will be noticeable across the hills so be aware of that. Mostly cloudy skies for the day on Wednesday. Warmer temperatures still a high of 39 degrees down around the base, a high a low of 27 up towards the summit and then mostly cloudy skies with some uh, evening showers and possibly some flurries out there as temperatures are well above freezing. Birchwood Interiors brings you your trail report. They're located in Village West, have some great deals, best prices in the nation on certain mattresses. So go check them out or check them out on birchwoodinteriors.com. But we are looking at some nice machine groomed and packed powder surfaces. 133 trails open. And we've got grooming last night on Timberline, Bridal Chain, Lower Double Bitter, uh, Tote Road, King's Landing, Hayburner, Upper Narrow Gauge, Spillway, Comp Hill, as well as Sluice and Gandhi Line, Wedge, Lower Winters Way, Candy Side Boardwalk, the Landing, and the Birches down around the base area. And on the east side, they'll get Ram Down, Two Hall, Wiffle Tree, Slasher, Buckboard, which is a great trail right off the top of the Wiffle Tree Quad, as well as Scoot, Windrow, Lower Glancer, and Good Chance on the west side. And Haywire will get all uh, smoothed out as well. And as you're headed up to Super Quad, you'll see them doing work on the Sidewinder Trail for next weekend's Border Cross event. 8.30 this morning, Snubber, Sawduster, and Skidway will move you around the base areas. 9 o'clock will get you up and down the Birch's Slope with the Muscalator uh, conveyor lift. At 8.30 as well, Double Runner East, Super Quad, and Skyline will get going to get you a little higher on the hill. And most of the mountain via Skyline and Spillway Crosscut. 9 o'clock, Wiffle Tree services the lower east side of the mountain for some great intermediate and advanced beginner terrain. Check out Moose Alley if you're here with the kids. King Pine and Timberline, they get going at 9 a.m. King Pine, some great expert terrain on the east side of the mountain. Timberline gets you way up to the top of the second highest mountain in Maine. And if you're a beginner, check out the Timberline Trail. You get some great views from the summit of Sugarloaf headed down that trail straight to Bullwinkles. 75K is open for classic and skate style down at the Sugarloaf Outdoor Center. Pickup hockey is going on Tuesday and Thursday. They've got rentals for everything down there, including snowshoes and ice skates. And they've got some great eats at the Boomus Bakery and Cafe, including that great view from the Lodge of the Mountain. Here's the events for Children's Week. Glowlight Parade and Fireworks tonight starting at 5 o'clock. Winter Carnival in the King Pine Room. January 10th, some uh, family entertainment and much more all throughout the week for Kids Week. Watch and win. We're going to kick things off on Friday evening, and then we'll do it Saturday morning, Saturday evening, Sunday morning, and Sunday evening. We'll qualify everyone for these outdoor research heated gloves, as well as the amalgam skis that we'll be giving away uh, later on in the season. So be sure to tune in to win. Watch and win with WSKI. Always a great time. You can find out more. Uh, of things to do to keep you busy here in the Maine High Peaks region at our website, www.skitv.com. You can find this latest local forecast as well as our live quad cam shot with our live video and time-lapse photography on there. Also check us out on social media, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram.